Hello, my name is Sarah Jane Brown. I am a landscape painter from Pembrokeshire and I have an exhibition here in Cardiff at Off the Wall Gallery in Llandaff. So the exhibition is called The Momentum of Colour. Um, it's focusing on the colours of the landscape and the colours that I use to try and recreate a, a series of emotions. This is the, the kind of main feature painting being very large. Um, it's called Ultramarine Pool um, because of obviously the blue in the foreground. Um, this painting is uh, loosely based on the beach where I live in, in St David's. It's almost bigger than my studio, so logistically it's quite difficult. Um, I have to kind of stand on a stepladder to get to the top and kind of <laughs> sit on the floor to get to the bottom. Uh, so I don't have enough ceiling height in my studio. Uh, not all my paintings have specific uh, landscape reference points. In fact, I usually uh, try and make them as ambiguous as possible. Once something becomes really recognisable um, as a specific place, then it becomes about the place rather than the emotion that I'm trying to um, evoke. I also had a, a kind of maritime career before I um, became a full-time painter. Um, so I've got a lot of experience of the sea and its movement and its various moods, obviously sometimes very calm and, and restful and sometimes really wild and very humbling. Um, I've been out um, at sea in four to ten gales, which is not particularly pleasant. This painting, which is called Momentum, which is partly where the title of the show comes from, um, it's just trying to capture that, that energy and movement. The sea is so elusive, it, even though it's a constant, um, you know, trying to capture that energy um, is, is quite a task. My technique um, when I'm starting to paint is usually um, just to lay down raw colour um, without really thinking too much about it. There's, there's nothing more scary than a big one blank canvas. So I will just uh, just start, literally. I never know where a painting is going to go. I never know what the end result is going to be. Um, I just start and let the paint kind of take me on a journey. I use a combination of techniques, so I can use quite thick um, paint, and that's done in a, in a quite um, bold st um, movement. Um, and then more considered, there's glazes on top. So glazes are like a thinned layer of paint, um, um, almost like layers of coloured varnish on top of something, if, you know, if you're familiar with that, sort of building up colour. Um, and uh, the colours beneath show through, and it gives an optical depth to the paint. So um, uh, be because the light bounces back from the, the base layer, it makes the colour more vivid than if you'd just applied a flat, a flat blue. <laughs> An optical blue does something to the eye, um, which doesn't really translate on camera or, or uh, in, a, in a still photograph. I always think that um, coming to see an exhibition of paintings in person um, is just very much more powerful because, you, this, because of this optical quality. Uh, that you just can't get from looking at a picture. It's a bit like the difference between going to a concert or listening to a recording. You know, the live event is always much more powerful.